Ismael Cortez, Program Manager for Project Shine in El Cajon. Who is most impacted by health literacy? In my organization, the refugee population is. Um, they have come from thousands of miles away, not knowing the language, uh, the verbiage, uh, acronyms that, that, that they hear every day that they're, that they're not used to. And let's face it, the American healthcare system is not easy. It's very complex. Uh, it's hard for me to understand many times as well. What we do at Project Shine is to have guest speakers at our sites. We have health professionals both from the medical and the mental health side and we also allow them to play learning games to help them find those resources, puzzles if you will, um, other sorts of learning games to help them find those resources, the verbiage as I mentioned before as well.